Hello and, hello and welcome to this new video. This is a special hardware video looking today at the AMD A4 4000 series processor. Now this processor was currently in was in my system when I uh, when I uh, first started upgrading the system. Uh, well, when I first built the system, should I say? Uh, now this processor, as you may expect, is an A series processor, and that means that it's it's not just a CPU; it's also a GPU, which AMD call an APU, which is um, which is a graphics processor and a CPU built in all into one chip. Now this isn't a very powerful uh, GP, uh, sorry, uh, processor by any standards. This is only a three gigahertz processor base, uh, can turbo up to three point two gigahertz, um, and uh, yeah, and as you can see, that's this is the actual processor, um, and as I said, it was originally in the system um, before I upgraded to the Athlon uh, AMD um, X4 processor which gives me a little bit more power than this thing did. Um, it's good in a way because it's got, uh, as I said, it's got a CPU and a GPU built all into one. Now um, the reason why I'm putting this video on is because I'm currently got this um, listed on the internet and I'm going to be selling it um, pretty soon um, for you know uh, so um, I thought well I might as well put a um, put a video on before I initially before I sell it now um, along with this package you get the standard uh, heat sink which um, is a stock heat sink so really it can only do the standard stuff that you uh, that, that come that the baseline that comes with the processor should I say and we have the, the nice shiny box now uh, as you can see on the cover this isn't especially grand uh, CPU, but it does the base things. It does everything that you want. It, you want a CPU to do. Plus, on the added bonus, it has a GPU built in, so you don't necessarily have to have a graphics card with this system. It's already got one on board. Um, um, uh, this has only got a low-end um graphics card built in. Um. And also, it's got the iFinity technology in, so you can run more than one monitor on it. Um, and as you can, whoops, as you can see, there's uh, the clock speeds. So it's an AMD A4 4000 dual core processor running at three gigahertz base with a three point two gigahertz max turbo. Um and uh, yeah, there's all that legal mumbo jumbo thing uh, that basically tells you what it is in various different languages, including English, right at the top, which is always a good thing. Um and uh, yeah, um, I was quite pleased with this processor in more in fact, um, it did. Give me a baseline for my uh, system, and but once I got myself a decent graphics card, um, this really became redundant. Really, it, it, I mean, you you can overclock it as it says there, but it's not really overclocking. It's just really just. Um, upgrade uh, running it a little bit of a high speed which people do in a sense call that overclocking 
but um, it's not overclocking in the full nature of of the uh, of the thing. Um, and uh, yeah, as you can see, I'm um, running this on uh, stood here, sat here, sorry, on my computer while I'm doing this. And uh, yeah, it's to, all to include. Uh, this is a really, really good baseline processor. Will give you hours of fun, and uh, but not really built for hardcore gaming. Which, since I built this channel, um, I've needed more and more and more gaming uh, um, horsepower, as you may say, uh, to to actually do the thing uh, to to do the channel so that's why i updated to the uh, the graphics card and uh yeah um i hope you like this little little look at this processor um and i and i'm gonna be back with more hopefully more hardware stuff um of different stuff that i get um right anyway i shall see you all pretty soon on another video uh please do like and subscribe and uh please share this with your friends so you, so um we can get this thing uh this channel more and more and more supported uh thank you for watching anyway thank you bye for now bye